Hey, what's up? Hi, everybody. Hi, Hi Dr. Dr. Nick. Nick. Welcome back. It's old Kevy Boy from Hats and Guitars. You know me. You've uh, been following me, and this is the Hat Show. So, it's the Hats and Guitars show. Lately, we haven't been doing as much guitars as we should. So, we're going to be getting a lot more hats uh, in, but I'm going to be stressing the guitar side of it in 2024. I've contacted a few guitar companies and... Uh, had companies to we're going to talk to Jiffy Steamer, all kinds of different people. KTG, KTG Hats. It's my hat company. It's our hat company. We've got a hat company. We can design our dream hats. We're going to be doing some new um, hats starting the first of the month. Officially, it's going to really start uh, next week. You know, after the week uh, is over, we're going to start again, and we're going to ask everybody out there what you would like to see in our next line of custom hats. There will definitely be an open crown, what we call a nostalgia model. We're gonna have the nostalgia in a big five and a half inch open crown, which is also available in a whippet crown. If you want a regular teardrop as well, we'll have that too. Um, that's gonna be style number one. We'll also have this style too, which we call the sky piece one. Okay, that is always gonna be available. We're going to see if we could keep running this one in mist, keep running it in, in green, and then we're going to have three new colorways we're going to introduce, okay? One of them might be an ash gray with a very light icy blue trim, which I thought might be nice, kind of a darker gray, not quite like a black graphite, not quite like a steel gray, somewhere like in, you know, a little, like a dark gray, this dark ashy gray with a uh, light icy blue trim. Ooh, that would be nice. Uh, that'll be one colorway. We're gonna have two other ones. I think they're gonna be tasteful. Gonna be, gonna be really cool colors and stuff. We're not gonna do something like, you know, yellow as one of our three colorways, you know? We're gonna do something really limited in colors. We're gonna make sure that all of the colors available are gonna be something cool, accessible, um, but wait, Kevin, how do I get in on this? What about these KTG hats? How do I get in on this, Kev? Now, some of you guys might be wondering, how do I get in on this? I want to help design these hats and stuff. Well, that's it. Hats and Guitars Facebook group. It's called Hats and Guitars Show Your Hats. You join up. So far, there's 641 members, but it's growing, and everybody in the group seems to be pretty cool. Uh, it's a very uh, cool, mellow, kind of a loving, gentle kind of a, a group. Very few squabbles or, or cork sniffers or, uh, or snobs or problems. And everybody's just learning from each other. Um, it's the first group I've ever been involved with. Look at that. He's wearing that hat, baby. Look at these people. Incredible. So if you want to help... Ah, oh, look. Amazing. Happy, Merry Christmas, everybody. So everybody's got the spirit, and um, I'm also, I have my vintage hats that um, I'm also helping um, to sell some hats for a couple that's in need right now. They need to liquidate their collection very badly. Um, so I sell some hats there. Uh, but you can only join basically not to sell things, but to show off your hats and to just communicate, you know, with everybody. And uh, it's more of that kind of a group. And if you want to really get involved with KTG Customs and help to design these hats yourselves, you can see everybody here and they know what they're doing. Look at these people. They look great. Look at the smiles on their faces, too. It's a fantastic group. You get to see me wearing goofy hats, too. And Christmas presents. Ah, look at that. Everybody, that's a straddle liner he got for Christmas presents. Ah, Merry Christmas, everybody. Happy New Year. So, um, it's an extension of, that's the photo of the year. I got to write photo of the year in there. So anyway, yeah, that's the hat photo of the year. So anyway, if you want to be part of this group, just get a Facebook group join i mean get a facebook page you know an account and then just join the group there's a group you put it in the search hats and guitars and you're good now back now to back my to boring, boring talk about ktg hats yeah. and uh you know the, the one that i already mentioned the ash gray with the light blue is i'm already getting a little bit um 
you know, that's that's something that I really want to do. It's um, an indulgency of mine. But after that, I think the color should be a little bit more easier to match with stuff. You know, I, I think the one I'm talking about will be easy to match with grays and blues and stuff like that. But uh, we'll have something to match earth tones and maybe something, you know, to match cool colors. But uh, we're going to vote. So we're going to take a vote on our styles. Maybe we, we're going to uh, suggest styles. And then we're going to take a vote on them. So uh, if everybody likes the Verity uh, three inch brim and then they like a uh, Hamburg style as the second, you know, most popular style to be voted on, those will be the two additional styles that we pick along with the nostalgia and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Um, I'm not going to design it. We're going to design our stuff together. Um, that's kind of cool. I think it's. I'm not going to say it's revolutionary, I'm sure it's been done before, but I think for a hat company, it's it's really neat. Let's see what this particular group, you know, this, uh, there is a group of six, seven hundred people in this hat uh, Facebook group. And then there is another group of uh, 15,000 to 45,000 who watch my videos. 15,000 are, are subscribed, supposedly. Uh, that's a very small amount of the people who watch me every day, though, that, you know, like, uh, it's only something like 15 or 20 percent of the people who watch me are subscribed. Oh, uh, what did you guys get for Christmas? I got a cool Bowie shirt. Look at this one. It's got Bowie in the front, and then it's got this on the back. It's cool, right? It's puffy, too. It's got, like, puffy stars on it. Like, silvery puffy stars. I think it's a John Vavarto's shirt. I like his shirts. They're really thin, light and thin, thin cotton. It's like my thing, wearing lightweight things. But anyway, uh, I don't know what you guys got for Christmas, but let me know. Tell me in, uh, in the comments. Tell me if you got anything really cool, you know, for the holidays, for Hanukkah or for Christmas. Um, is Kwanzaa like a real thing? Was that like invented by like a bunch of like, you know, politicians or something? Or is that like an actual thing that, you know, I heard about Kwanzaa, and they were actually talking about it in all the schools for a while. Then all of a sudden, everybody just got tired of it. They just stopped talking about it. So I don't know what the deal is with that. So if you celebrate Festivus or whatever you celebrate, you know, I just like to say, if I start giving you guys lots of blessings and telling you how much I love you, it becomes this, like, love fest for Kevin. And everybody starts saying, like, how much I love you, Kevin. The show is so important to me. So I'm not fishing for compliments. So I don't want to say that. But I just want to say at the end of this year, okay, you don't have to reciprocate, guys. Don't reciprocate. It's not why I'm saying this. But at the end of this year, I could look back and say, you guys helped me so, so much this year. Um, you picked me up when I was down, baby. You did all that stuff. And uh, I had like five, six cool careers kind of like, you know, on ice right now to pick from it and it's really amazing so um thank you guys thanks very much for being in my life and uh yeah you know i go i guess i'm like a mentor or a teacher to a lot of you guys but i learned so many things this year from starting to sell vintage hats i learned so many things from you people um i know what i know you know i could do this thing with the hats. I know about hats from about 1994 to today. You know, I sold hats for 30 years. I'm not a vintage expert. A lot of people out there really are. So I can humbly say I've learned so much from you guys, uh, both, you know, on the technical side of the hats and also kind of, you know, spiritually too, kind of like that. It kept, you know, you could go for it. Go for that brass ring, baby, you know? Aim high. And um, today, I could look back and say, hey, okay, this was a, a rough year. It was one of the roughest years of my life. But um, like Elton John says, you know, we're still standing, right? Everything is all right. What else can I want? Every, you know, and I've got you guys, a family of thousands. Um, so let's continue next year um, growing. There are a lot of things I wanted to accomplish this year that I did not accomplish. Um, and then there were a lot of other things we accomplished that we didn't even, you know, plan on doing. Uh, one thing I, I'd like to do is make a few road trips. I want to take a trip out to uh, New Haven to look at Delmonico hats and visit that 
a wonderful shop. It's like the biggest Stetson dealer on the, you know, the East Coast. Um, maybe that whole side of the country. He's a great shop. I've never even been there. Um, I want to take a, a ride out to uh, Capus, Capus Headwear. I want to go to East Village Hats. Um, take you guys on a few trips and show you a little bit of New York. So that's something we're going to do in the next month. We're going to do a little bit of that, a little bit of this, and we're going to show you some of the Sigma stuff that's coming, which is incredible. Um, I wanted to wait a little bit on that too, because I'm also learning what I have here too. What are these things made of? What's the models? What are they? This and that. So I don't want to just start teaching people about stuff unless I, you know, I know about them. So there's a lot of things in store for you for the new year. First of all, there's my hat company, which is actually our hat company, KTG Customs, Kevin Todd Gerber. Um, it's me, the buck stops here. It's not a big corporation. Uh, it's not family owned. It's not this owned. It's me owned. Okay. So like I said, the buck stops here. Um, I'm here. It's a personal business. You can talk to me. You could communicate with me. Um, what other companies do you talk to the CEO and uh, boss about designing hats and this, you know, that is the theory. That is the uh, concept behind KTG. It's not a, an invisible conglomerate that's owned by a whole bunch of people in some, some country you don't even know in some boardroom and this and that. It's me, okay? The buck stops right here, right in this room, right here. I don't pass it on to anybody else. Uh, if you get something and you know, you wind up uh, like uh, it's the wrong size or something, we talk about it, you know what I'm saying? We can work things out. So um, that's the reason why I chose my name for the company and not something catchier, like a one word catchy kind of thing, like Nike or, you know, a slash or fire rocket hats or I don't know, something cool and flashy and, and streamlined sounding, you know, like mint, right? Mint in bubble letters. That sounds really like trendy and cool. I don't want to be like that. I want to be buck stops here. This is the man. This is the guy. He's designing hats. He's got some experience. Uh, he's a no BS dude. And, um, you know, I want to be on the same wavelength as you guys. I want to be communicating on a, uh, what do you call it? On a... networking kind of thing where you know uh designer consumer everybody sort of networks together and we all think about what we want what the problems are what we should do and shouldn't do what we should avoid together okay do we want the hat prices to go up 10 bucks or do we want to cut out the whatever feature you know those are things we could decide as a you know do we want to have a more expensive box for the you know option we can decide all those things together. Now, um, we're building it slowly. We started with one model in two colors, okay? We're gonna work our way up to four models in three colors, okay? We're gonna do three new colors, plus the old two colors will be available in the sky piece, but only the sky piece. So if you wanted to do the sky piece in the three new color ways, you can do them. But if you wanted to do a sky piece one in either the mint green or a mist gray, it is possible. So in other words, you could go run two or you could go run one. Okay. So that's the way it's working. Um, we're going to build on them and make more styles as styles grow popular. We'll add more styles. If things become not that popular, we'll drop them and stuff. Uh, that's about it. I don't want to talk about too much, but I do want to talk about this. Um, we're going to start designing hat number one at the very uh, beginning of the week, beginning of the year. We're going to start that up. Hat number one is going to be nostalgia. Okay. We've already decided upon this. It's going to have a very high crown, open crown, so we could pinch it ourselves and crease it ourselves or steam it. Or if you don't want the high open crown, you don't want to mess with steaming and shaping a hat yourself. It's also going to be available in a regular whippet style teardrop. 
four and a half inch teardrop, which is a standard, like a wicker shape. So, you know, it'll look something like this, but not quite, you know, a little bit lower, maybe. So, that's it. Hat number one of KTG hats. It's not going to be a center crease, it's going to be a teardrop. Okay, it will definitely have a big binding this time, not a small binding. Very good chance we're going to have a little wider ribbon. There's a good chance we're going to have to vote on all that stuff. And maybe we'll even do something really funky and absolutely nuts like a back bow. Maybe that'll be ugly. Who knows? Some people like it. Maybe they want it. Other people think it's a little too weird and they'll go with a side bow. I personally, I'm undecided on the back bow because uh, I like the way they look on pork pies and things like that. But as far as, like, as, far as a hat like this, I'm not sure. Um, I like classical, that's the thing. I like simplicity and classical. Just a simple this, 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 you know what I mean? And I like it simple, not too much going on. That's something we're gonna decide, all of us together, all right? So, from this moment on, you, Shall service. <laughs> and now, folks, it's time to say good night. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night.